it seems like there's a specific need out there when it comes to iron supplementation for women. Mm -hmm. And we want to make sure that there's reasons why they should be taking this and they should understand why they do need to. Iron is one of the biggest deficiencies the world over, and it predominantly is going to impact women, to your point. And the reason being is women lose blood monthly through menstruation. And so we need to make sure that we're replenishing iron because iron is what makes up our blood and helps travel all that oxygen through our bodies. We're gonna inhale it, it's gonna travel through, and oxygen equals life without it we wouldn't be sitting here having this conversation right now. So when we're low in iron, we don't have enough of those cells that are gonna carry the oxygen throughout our body. So this would mean low in energy. Exactly yeah. what this means. That's, so that's, well, that's one of the predominant it. things that people who are, especially women who are experiencing low iron are going to complain of fatigue. Mm -hmm. Number one concern. Other ones that we hear about is like muscle weakness, going to throw a ball and it's, you got that weird muscle weakness in the arms. Also a tendency to get cold a little bit more quickly. Those are all kind of pointing us towards an iron, low iron. And the great thing is it's a simple test we can do with our doctor to confirm if we do have low iron. And if we do, supplementation really is going to be the answer. Of course, foods first, but we do need to fill in those gaps oftentimes.